Welcome to Winko Fireworks vlog number two. I am Dave Gucci Guccione. This is my caller, and we're going to try to hit on all of the important things that are going on right now in our industry. Um, but first, I just want to address new business with Winko Fireworks. We, we've had a lot of people reach out to us, and unfortunately, unless you've done business with Winko Fireworks in the year 2020, we will not be able to do business with you currently right now. Possibly, maybe near the end, if we have if we have product left over, we'll be happy to uh, reach out to you. But as of today, April 20th, we're only doing business with people who did business with Winko Fireworks um, in the year 2020. And that includes our Grandview Warehouse and all of our satellites. So with that great news, we're going to hand it over to my caller, and he's going to kind of bring everybody up to date. So, Good morning, everybody. Um, just wanted to give you a China update. This will probably be one of our last China updates. We're running out of days really quick. Um, Lots of inspection issues. You know, you have the CCIB, which is kind of the, their version of the CPSC and Customs. Um, you got, of course, AFSL testing, and and just the process is just taking a lot longer than we anticipated. You get new people out there that don't really understand the regulations, so it's 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 causing us some issues. Um, there's still some manufacturing issues overall. That's gotten a lot better, but there's still factories that don't have licenses, and that's causing a lot of issues. Um, you know, it's kind of a little too late, you know, on, on some of these items. They're really pushing, um, but it's just, it's just we're running out of days really, really quick because, as you well know, you have to get the items from either Liang, China, Jiangxi, Liling, and then get it loaded on the feeder and then get it down to Shanghai. Um, and then you've got all that finally planned. You're ready. And guess what? The ship from the United States hasn't come back. Um, and so because of that, First of all, there's container shortages in China, so it's hard to find containers. Obviously, there's huge space problems. So we're just running into a lot of, a lot of roadblocks. Um, we're just trying our best to, to, to do what we can to push these guys every day. Um, but everybody is. It's not just Winkle Fireworks. It's all, it's all the companies. And so, you know, I think that they're just trying to allocate, you know, uh, as fair as they possibly can. Um, okay, we finally get to the U.S. I think the L.A., Oakland area, West Coast congestion is getting a little bit better. Um, but it's, it's still kind of a crapshoot. I mean, we'll get something that, that left on the 6th of March, and we'll have it on the rail before the end of March. But then we've had stuff that left early February that's still in California. So uh, it's a constant battle. We're on them. Our brokers are on them. We're working with, with uh, First Trans out there. That's who our broker is and doing everything we can possibly do to get this stuff here quicker. Kansas City, we've had a lot of issues in Kansas City. I mean, guys, basically the system's overloaded. There's so many China goods, not just fireworks, China goods come to the United States. It's just an, it's an overload. And then everybody forgets the storms we had in Texas. That got us behind, and it takes a while to catch up. You know, we had a pretty tough winter in a lot of parts of the country. That gets the system backed up. And so everybody thinks that, you know, okay, it's, it's you know, the storms are over. Everything's going to be fine on a Monday. Well, it's not. It's going to take several weeks to get that backlog caught up, and it's just, it's just a vicious cycle. So... We're trying our best. They're trying their best. Um, and now the latest thing that's going to happen is, is our friends at CPSC have kind of woken up. They, we haven't heard a lot from them. A lot of them have been working from home and, and so forth. But now they're starting to look at a lot of the paperwork. They're sampling some items. So, um, you know, our stuff's all AFSL tested. So we're working with the AFSL. He might, may or may not know, has a brand new executive director, and, and he's come from CPSC. So he's, uh, he's helping, us out, helping everybody out as much as he possibly can. But we're, you know, it's, it's, once again, it's a big government agency, and we just have to do what we can do. Okay, assortments, the whole country's short on assortments. I think you guys know that. Um, we're waiting on our, our, some of our new assortment line that we brought out last year, King of the Block and some things. We're going to have them, guys. It's just going to be late. I mean, it's going to be late, like, like early to mid-June. That, that's yeah. late. Um, but, but we have confirmation that some are on the water, some are getting ready to leave, and, you know, we're, we're going to do the best to get you those things as soon as we can. The current ones we have now, we're obviously allocating so that everybody can get something. Um, we're trying to, you know, how we allocate is we look at what you ordered last year and maybe even the year before and this year and kind of do an average. Obviously, your orders this year are gigantic, but we just, we just aren't going to be able to fulfill everybody's trucks. Um, hell, we could, we could probably go home at the end of May if we wanted to. <laughs> yeah. But, we, you know, yeah. We, we just have never done that. We try to treat everybody as fair as we possibly can. Um, right now, the, the warehouse has a lot of orders. That we got in early. We still got some containers coming in, so we've stopped sending orders to the warehouse currently until we get a little caught up. And so we think that's going to be late next week before we're that caught up. 
It sounds uh, like they're making good progress, though. They're making. They're, oh, the guys are working. We're working seven days a week, guys. We're working. You know, we're we're starting our night crew in early May instead of late May. So we're doing everything we possibly can. Um, and Neil, who does all our logistics, is is having one heck of a time yeah. getting trucks. Once again, the system's overloaded. So there's not a lot of trucks. The rates are not pretty. Um, and so what what I ask of you guys when it comes to the trucking is is you, you kind of got to go on. It's really not our schedule. It's the, it's the trucker schedule. But, you know, and, and take it whenever you can get it. You know, if you got to take if you have another job, you got to take off work. You almost got to do that. Um, you know, if we hear, well, I can only take it on weekends or I can only take it after five. Fine. You're just probably going to go to the bottom of the pile. Um, it's just the way it's going to happen. We have to move stuff out and we have to keep the system going. And when we get a hiccup like that, it just it just throws the whole thing in a tizzy because there's, there's just not enough trucks out there. For everybody, so when we finally get a trucker decides to take your load, and all of a sudden you say, "Oh no, I really don't want it till Saturday. I can't get any help on, you know, Friday morning." It's gonna be a problem. It's gonna be a big problem. Um, but that's all because of the high demand for trucking. Did not, and on top of it all off, you know, there's hardly there's not enough trucks, and then you have to have a hazmat to haul fireworks. So, you know, just lots of obstacles. We're going to be as fair as we possibly can. We're going to be up front with you. Um, but we need you to help as well. And, and some of you guys have been great. You understand it. You just want your product. And, and we're doing the best we can. Um, you know, some of these trucks are, wow, they're expensive going out. But yeah. that's just this whole new, you know, all this freight going up and, and the, the R&B. And, you know, we're already here next year. Prices are going up overseas. So we might as well just get ready for that as well. So anyway, um, that's about it. Yeah. You know, Mike, I think that we really appreciate the customers that have reached out to us early and your understanding of the situation. Um, I would say that's 99.9% of most of our customers have understood the situation. But once again, we want to get the word out about we are not doing any new business. We're trying to take care of our existing customers and the logistical situation with trucking. I, I can't stress enough that your cooperation is going to make it better for you. You're going to get fireworks Earlier with better fill, um, we, I uh, I had I had a contact with a LTL company that says they're they're running at 130 percent of capacity, so that's just one LTL company. Um, the 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 domestic logistics right now are very challenging on top of everything else. So um, your cooperation with, is truly appreciated, Mike. Anything else you can think of? No, just uh, bear with us. It's going to be a unique season. Uh, we all know it's, we're going to sell everything we can possibly get, I think. I, I really do think the retail is going to be good this year. Um, so just bear with us, you know, and you're going to be getting shipments and probably also some very late shipments as the late stuff comes in, we hope. We, we've got stuff leaving as late as May 12th. It's, it's, we, we're taking a big risk that it's going to make it in, but we're going to push ahead of time and try to get in here. And we get it in, we'll get it out, yeah, that's for sure. No doubt. we got to get it in. All right, everybody, have a great day, evening, or morning whenever you're viewing this. Uh, for Mike Collar, I'm Dave Guccio and Winko Fireworks, and thanks a lot for our vlog update here, and hopefully our next vlog update will have some better news for you. So anyway, have a great day. We'll talk to you later. Thank you. Thank you very much.